Hello everyone, how's it going? My name is Emerus and welcome to Guardians of the Galaxy, a game that I've now wanted to play for quite some time. Um, I've heard some good reviews about it, it's actually quite a good game from what I've heard. It came out two years ago in 2021. I'm a big Guardians fan, I've watched all the films, and I cannot wait to see what this game is like. So with that being said, let's get into it. All oh, right, okay, we're already playing it. Uh, that's cool. Now, one of the cool features actually about this game is that it does have a streamer mode. So, if you ever wanted to stream this or record this, you can because any copyrighted music in the game, you'll be able to put this feature on and it'll take all the copyrighted stuff out. Now, I assume we're playing as Peter then because I can see this magazine here and you've got Star Lord on the front of it. I don't know if this is where he like got the idea from to become Star Lord. So, I'm not too sure if this game is like somewhat related to the films, I'm not too sure, or it's its own, like, unique story to it. Star-Lord? Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary, he's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm-hmm. Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> oh! Peter! We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. Alright, so we're still here then when he was still a kid. The music is pretty uh, awesome actually to listen to. Oh man, I can't wait to play this. Maybe I can convince Annie to buy it with his paper out money. Uh, right, so what do we look like then? Hang on, have we gotten into a fight? Because we got like a black eye. Yeah, we have been in a fight somewhere. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. Three natural ones in a row last game. Some barn I turned out to be. <laughs> All right. That's how you... Oh no, hang on. Oh no, because you're actually playing something. Need to build up my calluses. Right. So, 
I do want to look around at everything, but at the same time, I would like to see what's gonna happen when we go upstairs and just check this out quickly. Keep hitting those dingers, George, and you'll make it in the Hall of Fame for sure. Uh, what's happening? Get a quilt and wake up. Holy crap, Drax. You gotta stop doing this, man. It's weird. You're approaching the quarantine zone. How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin her mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her. We'll try. We're supposed to be a team. I make no promises. Ah, uh, Drax, always one of my favorites. Star Lord. Right, so are we gonna <laughs> just admiring ourselves in the mirror? Just the junkyard. The quarantine zone's the biggest pile of galactic war debris in the known universe. Just think of all the tech we can find. Chapter one: A risky gamble. Hey, it's only illegal if Novacor finds us inside, which they won't. Ah, oh, there you are, Quill. Tell Groot to stop worrying about getting arrested. I am Groot. I'm not overconfident. I'm just the right level of confidence. Uh, reassure Groot or spook him. Uh, let's reassure him for now. <laughs> Arrested? For what? <laughs> our ship just accidentally slipped into the quarantine zone. Oops, our navigation malfunctioned. Oops. <sighs> How would we accidentally cross into the Novacore force field? <sighs> Details! <sighs> Nice gizmos rocket. I'm calling them thumpers on account of the noise they make. Assuming we get past the force field and reach your coordinates in one piece, all we gotta do is set them up, and these babies are gonna draw out our monster in no time. <laughs> okay, investigate Thomas, let him work. Uh, Alright, I'll let you finish up. Alright, I'll let you get back to it. Sounds like catching that monster will be easier than we thought. Yeah, the faster we catch it, the faster we get paid. I do like the uh, the models on them. They pretty much look exactly well. I mean, they are really from the um, the actual movies, the films. All oh, right, okay, we just shut in that. Don't know if I can interact with each of them. Uh, what's Drax doing? He's fighting Drax. the air. Belcamora. Can this not wait, Peter Quill? I am readying my body for battle. Uh, <laughs> you know we're supposed to capture this monster, right? Not kill it. Of course. But I suspect it will not go down without a fight. Cool it, muscles. Lady Hellbender ain't gonna buy damaged goods. I will aim to preserve the integrity of the beast as best I can. Good. Oh, we do need to capture this thing, All then. good, buddy? You know, I don't understand you, group, but I'm gonna assume you just said something super kind and thoughtful. <laughs> What did the tree say? No idea. I'm afraid I don't speak Groot, so no, I have no idea whatsoever. Now, is there like a way to sort of like pinpoint what I need to, like where to go exactly? Um, I'm just gonna... Mm. Gamora? Up here, Peter! Hey, that's my chair. Oh, then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, strategizing. It's one thing to get into the zone, but we still got to catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. 
Now, if you're done strategizing, feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Nice, into the captain's seat we go then. Oh no, hang on, we can talk to Gamora. Rocket! Once we breach that force field, there's no going back. Your black market codes are gonna crack that Nova net, right? Yep. As soon as you enter them in your console. Right, okay. Uh, let me just get in my seat then. <laughs> okay, here we go. Rocket Groot Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Core security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. And if we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Nova net still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. 0451. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. Zero. It's not that simple. The code only works on four. this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal core. There. I had to punch in that code quickly before I forget. <laughs> right, off we go, our first mission into the quarantine zone. High security Nova Corp sector, somewhere in the Andromeda galaxy. And we're in! Incredible. I realized there was so much stuff left after the war. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Roland. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overall. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoth 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster. That big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <laughs> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Group Quill Soda. Team Rockets up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks at the drop side. The ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, group. Don't worry. Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle, and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. All right, let's do this. So you have to place these thumpers down to bring the monster out, and then we'll meet up to take it on. Thumper one, done. Meet you at the rendezvous point. Gamora, take care of my baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Ah. Oh, can you imagine? Right, uh, track what? visor R3. Cool. It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. Oh, hang on, hold R2 to scan. Uh, interactive brittle material, press a foreign orgasm, fragile structure. In visor mode, the compass is displayed at the top of your screen and points... Oh yeah, because there it goes on top, doesn't it? So I can switch it on and off whenever That's I want. totally safe. 
Now, can we please focus less on the toxic goo and more on all this cool war junk it's holding together? Visor works. Sure it works. I checked it right before we left. Did you just put checked it in quotes? What? No. So with this, then you can scan anything. Everybody keep an eye out for any good scrap or components. I am Groot. This is actually pretty cool. The first priority. I'm just saying, if you see anything good along the way, pick it up. Well, how do I, I mean, do I shoot this stuff down and then it just like becomes a material I can use? Um, so what was that one thing I picked up before? Now follow rocket, it says, but rocket's back there. I assume maybe I just need to go ahead and see what I can see. It is strange. I have not encountered any corpses in the wreckage. Hmm. Probably got disintegrated when the ships went kaboom. Or the nano resin absorbed them. Could explain its propagation. <gasps> or the closed atmosphere accelerates decomp, and any body is just dust by now. I will require a vigorous scrubbing when this mission is complete. I'm thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... pink goo. Ebrium-based nanoresin. Whatever. I'm just saying it's a lot to take in. You know, I think I do sort of get it. Oh, look! Yellow and blue. Looks like an old Nova Corps frigate. Nice! Come yeah, because we're on a dude. ship, it looks like. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why do you even bring us here if the place is so sacred? I can name at least a dozen uh, Make some cash or build right reputation. Here. Don't know if you noticed, Rocket, but people aren't exactly falling over themselves to hire us. Oh, I have noticed. If this job pans out, sure we'll get money, but also a rich new client. We need to impress Lady Hellbender with a monster she's interested in, not just any old critter. Which is why we should have gone after Fin Fang Foom. We won't impress no one if we're dead. How the... Whoa! Okay. I'm okay. Ha! <laughs> Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. I mean, I did. I failed the first time round. Uh... You know, I like this. This is fun. The three of us, hanging out, just like when we started this gig, before you-know-who joined us. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Fan new Quill's members. A, a swell guy. Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Is that why your plan has Drax and I taking the ship? Maybe. Hey, can't a guy with kind of just said, him from us. Uh, we've scanned that. An antenna. Yeah, I, I don't know if I do things with, like these items I can scan. Peter like Will. the insubordination of the assassin has become insufferable. I'm doing exactly what we planned to do. She is also quite contrarian. We talked about this on the Milano Drax. Try harder. Whoa! Oh, nice little ride. You sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, so, Root, you think we can find pieces of the Trion shard in here? You never heard of the Trion shard? All right, we'll go in this way. Pyramid of pure evil that corrupts everything it comes in contact with. I am Root. Making things up. Name one time I ever... I am trying to look around and make sure I'm not missing anything, but... Know the other way was a dead end. Because unlike you, I am very I'm okay. Jesus. Uh, I'm okay. Oh, you're supposed to go down there. I didn't scare you, did I? No. Aw. You were worried. That's cute. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it's safe it. Safer than flying with Kamora anyway. I heard that. <laughs> the jokes in this uh, game between them all. Uh, actually, yeah, there is some stuff down there. Just have a little look around over there, see what I can find. Rodent. What is this omnipresent pink substance made of? You mean the Ebrium based nano resin cluster foe? Never trust something with that many dashes in its name. Is it caustic? Not if it stays outside you. Just don't eat any, or get any in your eyes. That's why I wanted to know how to sprint. It seems like it's L2, so. Keep that in mind. Advanced components. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. 
<laughs> Brittle material okay, can be destroyed no blast worries. of fire. But watch your step, guys. This junk isn't as stable as you think. Take that, brittle stuff. Alright, so they do overheat, so I can only use it for uh, so long. Well, so far it's going great. It, it uh, looks and feels great. When we actually get into some combat, it'll be uh, interesting to see. <laughs> nice splatter. Hey, 50 units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Whoa, what the? Wait. Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? Considering how many times I fixed the Flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Ah, right. So we're on a bit of a Optimal bit of competition. Bumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm thinking right in front through the giant hole where this ship's cockpit used to be. Well, that's grim. What's this? Uh, yeah, try not to think about it. It's better not to wonder what happened to anyone working on these old wrecks. It was a long time ago, anyways. You know, this is some kind of collectible. Looks like it. Uh, oh no, hang on, I put it back down. Oh, it's like message logs that you can collect in the game, perhaps. And what's this? Law. Oh, hang on, do I shoot the... Because, oh no, hang on, it just says law, so hang on, I need to... Oh, I can't shoot behind it. Alright, I thought maybe I just uh, free it up if I destroy all that, uh, well, stuff, all this pink stuff. I actually know what it is. Some kind of like... Catch up. Okay, there's a crapped out Nova Corps missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. Okay, track and visor. Reunite with rocket. Uh, yes, the compass is on top. I should be okay. crawling through creepy old ship. No big deal. Easy there, Quill. Pretty sure nothing's gonna jump out at you. Except maybe me and Groot. Okay, a bit of a surprise then from you both. Is it this? Oh, hang on, this is the gunk stuff, isn't it? I need to shoot. How much of the war did you see, Rocket? Only the bits that happened as I was doing other jobs. Floor! Trying to bring the whole place down, Quill? I shot a thing. I get it. First tool in the old toolbox. <clears throat> Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh, God. What the hell is that? Uh, use our stick to aim and hold L2 to lock onto a target. Okay, and then... Okay, shoot, right. Whoa, what the fuck? You dead, Quill? We can hear your wussy squeal even without the cops. Little busy! Whoa, okay. That's cheating. You guys should have seen that. It was this weird... Press square thing. to perform a melee attack. Not falling for this again. All oh, right, I just punted it in the distance. <laughs> okay, got a few more. <laughs> oh, I got more incoming. Do I keep moving as I kill these things on my staying here until they're all dead? Oh, there we go, right. Everything okay over there? Quill nearly got himself eaten by a blob or something. Should have heard him squeal. You must fight with dignity, Peter Quill. Or at least die with it. Not funny. Right, which way am I going? I got like, I don't know, some kind of like XP bar or something. Like that. It said I was, oh, it just said fantastic. I don't know, maybe I, if you hey, take hits. Make sure the Milano don't get stuck in any of this resin. If she did, I would wrench the ship free. Don't worry. I've flown worse ships through worse situations. Just make sure I'm going the right way. Yeah, it's up here. I assume these components are like the currency in the game. Oh, I used to upgrade weapons and armor. I don't know if they even is. Like, you can get different weapons and armor. Uh, well, we got a lot riding on your gal pal. 
Val's mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. Like you could even tell if she had an honest face. Pitch back a plan. Trust in the plan. Trust in the plan, guys. Everything is checked out so far, right down to the mining ship. We put our thumpers in the right places, and we'll bag that monster. Will knows all about putting thumpers in the right place. <laughs> and getting monsters in the sack to mother of Scott! Jesus. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, are you kidding me? Really careful here. Okay, hold L1 to open the Guardian's option, then square to ask Groot right, to make a Groot. bridge. Let's see that cool vine. Oh, oh, That's one hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross. More ship eaters. Oh, they're oh. everywhere. Let's get this. All right, back to business. Boom. Right under your nose, Quill. Damn it, I was getting components, that's why. I wasn't... I'll have to uh, keep an eye out. I assume that's the way we're supposed to be going. Do I look worried? The resin will hold. I am Groot. You ain't that happy. How the hell do I make that jump? We gotta go that way, across the gap. Can we Somehow. make another bridge? Uh... Groot, I found a hitch. Can you latch onto it? I'm Groot. Hey, Greenies. Yeah, there we go. See blue and gold ships out there? You let us know. We have seen many such ships. He means active ones. We haven't talked about what to do if we run into a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we'll restrain them until we're done here. Bad idea. Those cops are all connected through their stupid helmets. If, if you see cops, you get my ship out of here. Even if it means leaving us behind. Uh, flark that! Trust me, I've dealt with Nova Corps before. Even helped them catch real criminals. I can talk my way out. You think that Milano can outrun a fully powered Nova Centurion? She's done it before. Okay, here we go. All right, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. Flark! No, no! Flark and Skaggy! Attack and batteries fried, that's what's wrong. That's just fine a solution. The solution's a new battery, with a charge. Okay. We're on what's left of a ship. Full of ship things. Gotta be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. Yeah. You find a replacement. Can you use this missile? Sure I can. To blow us okay, to pieces. Rocket, a charged battery. Where are these little things? Dead battery. Well, I can destroy this stuff here, so I'm wondering if this brings us down something. Yeah, hello. Just quickly scan it, make sure. The fact that it's yellow makes me think. Yeah. It looks like a spacey car battery. Okay, this thing isn't gonna zap me, right? The chance is minuscule at best. You'll be fine. What are you waiting for, Quill? Grab it. I've already got it. There, there we go. go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Those things again. Just grab the battery and give it a yank. Hold L1 to open Guardians mode. Square to select Groot. And press square to ask you to entangle enemies. Oh, right, okay. Groot is a vigorous defender, able to withstand high amounts of damage. He focuses on crowd control. His basic ability entangles and mobilizes enemies in a small area for a short amount of time. Which is exactly what's happened here. Bye -bye, so can we do it again? Yeah, there we go. Well done, Groot. Get out of here. Thanks for the heads up, 
There's a purple one. Oh, okay, that's our fight. Uh, Groot, can you do your thing again? Okay, circles the pump for quick dash attack. I'm overcharged. Well, overheated, I should say. <laughs> oh. oh, it's on a cooldown. Right, okay. Get out of here. Oh, they multiply. So when you kill the purple ones, they turn into the uh, the green ones. Okay, so that's a little quick dash circle. Okay, well, luckily they're staying up there. There we go. Nice. Really coming out of the woodwork. These bombers have gone to their room. We're all plugged in. Wow. Just in time. I'd like to see you fix it next time. Come on. Two down, two to go. What are these green things that are being left on the floor? They like XP. I don't see any way out of the missile bay except that passage, but... Well, we found a way out. Hi, Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? If the two of us gotta lug that monster- Guys, we deliver this monster to Lady Hellbender, we'll get bigger payouts, and jobs that don't suck. A ship for each one of us! I mean, a team only needs one ship. Perhaps a more spacious ship. Man, that thing is ridiculous. I think it was a ship or a robot. That's a Cree Sentry. A robot, but... No oh, the Cree. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least How five do you experimental know? models twice that size. How do you know all this? Because they were my fellow experiments back on Half-World. Most of my parts came from the cybernetics hangar next to the door, so... Uh, I got a sneak peek at all the new killbots. I just seen the something over here. Go from my... Uh, uh, my cage. I didn't mean to open old wounds. Eh, most of them are just scars now anyways. This old Kree tech gets me wondering, where would I be now if those blue butt scots managed to keep me locked into their half-world experiments? Hi, Groot. <laughs> yeah, chances are you'd be climbing over bits of me right now. I wasn't even a person for the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. More like a real smart walking Wait. gun. A very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. The entire facility was the problem. I wish I'd gone back and blown it up before the end of the war. If you're going that way, I assume this is like a bonus thing over here. <laughs> ah. Alright, just shoot all this so I can get back. Just keep your eyes on that mining ship. That's where we want to end up. What's a mining ship doing in the middle of all these fighters anyway? Eh, they don't call them casualties of war for nothing. Alright, let's keep moving. Oof. So these jumps are really tight. Oh, hello. Get my score up a little bit more. So I, may, I think I just need to keep an eye Laura, out for these things. When are you going to share your contacts and sources? When will you share yours? What? You know about all my guys. Only that you've got a guy that makes it You've got a guy who can reconstruct faces. You've got a guy who never says no. <laughs> oh, yeah. I love that guy. Group, you're up. I need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Oh no, you don't. You ain't taking that. Yes, I'm about to win this match. Well, no, you're not. You're not. You're not. You're not. I'm actually blocking you, so I. One of these things we already killed. <laughs> we're inside a giant robot head, and I got robot parts inside my head. Oh, I'm trying to get to the other side of that. Inside a giant robot head. Hey, Groot. What do you think I should do when I win this bet? 
I mean with the units he'll owe me once I win. I can't get the other side. Oh no, I did. There we go. Well, I know what I'll be doing with my winnings. I'm saving up for our next stop on Contagia uh. to get one of those Zeronian massages. Uh, you're so predictable. There's another one there. And that's another one again. Let's see. When I beat Quill, I'm gonna get my hands on some rotating hyper circuits. Just realize how the hell do I Oh there we are. No one knows what those are. Found a nest! Maybe this is the Parasite Clubhouse. Right, we are you know winning. What, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. Then lose the second pistol. All right, thumper goes there, Quill. So this is our last thumper, I think. It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. Rocket! I only flipped the switch Guys, and mode. Even started. Gotta love that kill radius. Whoa! Rocket is a weapons expert who attacks from a distance. He focuses on damaging multiple targets at a time. His basic ability, Cluster Flak Bomb, deals moderate damage to everything in the impact area. So let's try and use them both together now a bit. So Groot immobilizes them. And then Rocket. There we go. Nice. What the hell is this thing? Uh, Groot, can you keep it still? And then rock it while it's still... Oh no, you're on a cooldown, never mind. Actually... Oh, nice! Oh no, there's more. Kill them. Don't feel bad, buddy. They started it. Uh, do you want on that one, that big one? Rocket is your bomb, but no, not quite yet. Oh, it let me know when he's got his thing back up. I just see now bottom right hand corner as I got attacked there. Not a chance. I've gotten way more. No. Groot. He's nearly dead. There we go. New ability point. Oh, come on! You can't just give yourself points like that! You're saying he's cheating. You've reached... Uh, you've received an ability point. Use the... Uh, the uh, little button there to access guidance menu. Ship. Every thousand XP points will grant you a new ability point. Use them to unlock new skills for team members. So let's access it. We'll just want to go over this real quick. So if we do Peter Quill, it seems that we have... Playing as him. Uh, hold X, spend one ability point, acquire the Vantage Point ability, which Star Lord initiates a prolonged burn of his jet boots, rising to a tactical adventurous position to give orders or attack enemies. Alright, oh, okay, that's pretty cool.